Welcome to tutorial days and in this video you are going to know how to connect your website with search engine console. As you know search engine console is one of the very important tools provided by Google but before that before uh, getting advantage of this search engine console first you need to connect your website and verify. The main thing is you have to verify your website that you are the real owner of the website only then you can get advantage of and features uh, of search engine console so step by step i will show you that how you can connect your website with search engine console so let me show you how to do that so this is one of my websites so i'm going to connect with this one okay with search engine console so before that you need to log in into your gmail account so let me show you how you can search from here you search in google search engine console then search engine console here so this is the url hmm. search.google.com then start now then you need to select your gmail account since i'm already logged in so it didn't prompt me to log in but in case you are not logged in then first you'll have to log in into your google account apart from that if you have more than one google account in that case you'll have to select which account you want to connect with so in my case i would like to connect with this account okay with the gmail account so now what you need to do is first click here and then add property here it will show you different domains which is already added or connected so this time i'm going to connect with this domain and then so add property here you can see add property so let's click here once you click here then you will be given two options two options the first option is you need to just provide any of the one URL for example there can be several URL let me show you what does it mean this is one of the URL this one is one of the URL this one HTTPS www this one is one of the URLs and this one okay so you can see there is only one website but here is without www or http in this case and in this case there is www and in this case there is https www and here https then is soft is of the asm so and here w with https and ww so if you connect any of the one domain in this case in first in first case then you won't have to add different domains automatically it will detect all versions of domain this is called different versions of your single domain so but in this case what happens you will have to add every time first with ww first with without ww first with https and second one with without https now though this one adding with this one is very easy but but you have to add manually all these versions of your url but in this case there is a bit complexity not very com very complex but uh, there is a bit complicated as compared to this because you have to verify your dns but the benefit is that you just add one version and automatically it will detect other versions also so let me show you with this version so first i will add here with www then continue now we have to see this option here it says that in dns we need to add this t 
txt record okay so now let's go to here and then just copy this this one just copy this and then if i go to godaddy here in this case then it says that the information is managed by my hosting details not here mm, let me go back if i go here and click on dns manage dns then it says that the dns records define how your domain behaves like some your web website content and delivering your email so the dns information we can't display your dns information because your name servers are managed by ours that means my website this website is hosted by some other hosting company it's not hosted with godaddy only the domain is registered with this, this domain but it's not hosted here it's hosted in some other hosting so i need to go to there with my hosting so my sorry here is my domain hosted so i'll go here now you need to go to you you log into c panel here okay then you need to click on dns domain security advanced okay. dns let's search here dns here under domains you will see john editor here john editor this one so click here and then i will select my website so this is my website and then manage so if you see here what does it say where was it yeah it is saying that on inside the txt i need to copy this okay so i will just add record click on add record of two times okay. then i will select here txt okay and then here text record and here it will be this domain name simple now save okay it's saved now let's go here and click on verify yes so you can see it says that your domain is successfully verified now go to property and then you can see it's verified and you can see different details here since it's newly added that is why there is no any information currently but after 24 hours you will get other details here wherever you will click in different uh, video i will show you this search engine console that what are these and how this works but for this video it was enough to show you and the purpose was itself uh, that how to connect your website in this search engine console so guys hope you like uh, and also one more thing uh, here if under this add property if i add here with https version okay https this then continue then as you can see it says the domain is already verified that means i don't have to worry at all it is already added here both the versions it's already added but in second case it will say 
that no that one is not verified means every time i have to check this code and verify so what i will do uh, i will connect uh, another domain here to show the second option okay so let me go to my uh, domains my domain list and let me find uh, so which website should i connect okay this one i'll connect with this one this time okay so for second option i will click here and add property here and i will add here www then okay continue in this case what you will have to this is one of the most easiest way to verify so what you need to do just download this file and then I go to this domain so it's inside my hosting so you need to log in into a C panel and then so where is my that domain mm, looks like that domain is not added here must be here somewhere yeah so I'll click on manage I'll upload from file manager okay through file manager if you have cpanel then you can upload from there also then here under public html i'll upload here So it's uh, download then this file upload was so successfully uploaded now I will check here verify oh it says on a C verification field let me check Oh, my this domain is not actually hosted there that's why uh, it's saying that's not verified okay actually this is not connected with DNS so let me take another domain like uh, which one so anyway you understand what I mean that once you upload then you just click on verify then it will be successfully verified and now if your website is let me show you if your website is on wordpress that i was talking about that time so how i will connect this let me show you let's close it this one also this one also this one also this one also now i will go here and just click and continue then there is an option this is the easiest option click on html tag then copy okay now i will go to its admin and then appearance and then theme file editor and here find your uh, this one and find your header so this is theme header under this header before closing head tag you need to paste this code just I paste it then upload, update now let's check if it's verified or not so click on verify 
and yes you can see it's successfully verified so guys this way you can verify your domain with searching console so there are two ways and i showed you both the ways so hope you like this video and still if you're not subscribed my channel then please subscribe my channel and also comment write your comment in comment box so thanks for watching bye bye